Hi everybody, meteorologist Joe Thompson with you here from the WNWO Weather Center. Hope you're all having a great weekend. The weather was okay, but not the best out there for Saturday. Kind of breezy during the day and that will continue for our Sunday as well. Let's show you the setup right now across the Great Lakes. There are a couple of isolated showers, especially Saturday morning before we did get a little bit of sunshine to pop out during Saturday afternoon. And that trend is basically going to continue for our Sunday as well. It's going to be basically a near repeat in terms of the forecast. We'll see a mix of clouds and sun and there may May be an isolated shower or two across the area as we go through Saturday night and into the day on Sunday. However, there's really nothing very well organized, so it won't be a washout. And if we do see any showers, they're likely to be on the light side and shouldn't be lasting too long. Temperature wise, we are below average out there. We only reached the low 60s Saturday afternoon, so not bad, but that is again a little below average. Typically, we top out in the upper 60s as we head into the beginning of May, so that's where we should be. You do see the warmer air off to our south and west temperatures in the 70s back towards the Missouri region, but it's going to take a few more days until that warmer air does arrive. However, once it does arrive, we're really going to see the temperatures shoot up, especially by the tail end of next week. Quick look at your TrueView forecast. Like I said, there's a little bit of energy in the upper levels of the atmosphere. May trigger a spotty shower or two as we go through the overnight Saturday into the early morning hours on Sunday. I do think most of us will get through the day Sunday on the dry side, though. Again, can't rule out maybe a stray shower or two. But like I mentioned, it will be brief and will not last too long. So if you have any outdoor plans, you can hold on to them. Although, again, it will be breezy out there. We'll be seeing gusts up to 25, 30 miles per hour out of the west northwest. And then we do it all again for Monday, though it won't be as windy. But we could still see a spotty shower or two as we go through Monday. And temperatures are going to be even cooler as we kick off the new work week. For the rest of our Saturday night and Sunday morning, expect variable clouds. Temperatures bottoming out in the mid-40s. That is actually fairly seasonable for this time of year in terms of the low temperature. The Winds a little bit on the brisk side from time to time, getting up to around 10, 15 miles per hour with those isolated light showers across the area. And for Sunday, partly sunny with a stray shower possible. But like I mentioned, I think most of us get through the day dry. Temperatures though will struggle to reach 60 degrees and it's going to feel even cooler with those winds out of the west northwest between 15 and 25 miles per hour. So kind of gusty out there once again. More spotty showers for your Monday. Highs only in the mid 50s, so you'll certainly need that jacket when you head out the door Monday morning. As we head towards Tuesday, we do dry out. Temperatures getting a little bit closer to our average levels into the mid 60s with more sunshine. Wednesday, a warm front will be moving through. That could bring some scattered showers and thunderstorms. And look at Thursday. We're going to make a run for 80 degrees here in the Glass City. We have not seen 80 degrees since the beginning of last October. So it has certainly been a while, but certainly going to be seeing those temperatures really shoot up for the end of next week and around 80 degrees for Thursday. We slip back a little bit on Fridays. There will be a chance for some scattered showers and thunderstorms to wrap up the week. And that trend will continue into next weekend, especially for next Saturday. So it's kicking off prom season and it could be a little bit wet for some of the high schoolers as they head off to the dances across the area. But for the most part, after Monday, temperatures appear to be in the 60s and 70s and, and leave that one shot at 80 degrees for your next Thursday. That's a look at your forecast. Enjoy the rest of your weekend.